Students, when we study phonetics, we come across airstream mechanism. Now, what is this airstream mechanism that we want to understand today? Then listen, airstream, okay, that produces sounds is called airstream mechanism. That means, you know, when you want to produce a sound in any language, you know, the air comes out from the lungs okay the process of of inhaling the air and exhaling the air is called airstream mechanism depending on the kind of exhaling and inhaling you know we have two types of airstreams and they are aggressive airstream and ingressive airstream so there are two types of air streams, okay? Ingressive and aggressive. The name itself tells us what they are. Aggressive, that means when something comes out, okay? When the air flow is outward, it is called aggressive. When the air flow is inward, it is called ingressive. While producing the sound, if you know the air comes out from the lungs through our mouth and nose it is called aggressive airstream most english sounds are aggressive airstream sounds okay in the same manner ingressive i told you when the air goes inside and it produces a sound it is called ingressive airstream most of the times you know such sounds are not produced in many languages around the world but if you see some of the scandinavian languages or some of the dutch languages they have a system of producing a sound while inhaling while taking the air inside okay like you know they want to show sympathy then they produce a sound like <gasps> so that is ingressive sound but in english language there is no ingressive airstream there are three types of initiators in this mechanism initiator means the sound begins from three different places okay there are three uh, places from where the sound is initiated the organ which generates which initiates a sound is called an initiator so there are three number one is the lungs as you can see uh, okay in the lungs we have diaphragm okay from there from that particular place the air flows upward and outside so lungs is the place from where the sound comes okay and such sounds are called pulmonic sounds in phonetics the second one is glottis and glottis as you can see uh, in this picture it is found here at this place inside okay some sounds are produced from here the air comes out from the lungs but you know there is some friction here in glottis and that sound is called glottical sound and the third one is the tongue okay and these sounds you know the tongue which you can see in the picture the sounds which are produced uh, with the help of tongue and from the mouth are called uh, linguistic sounds and they are also known as velar sounds so in short there are two air streams okay ingressive and aggressive and there are three initiators the diaphragm or lungs the glottis and the tongue i hope this video is helpful to you please do share this video among your friends and classmates thank you for watching thank you